Hello Golf, past Martin Hall coming to you from the magnificent Lake Nona Golf and Country Club in Orlando, Florida. I want to pass on to you what I think is the absolute best short game piece of advice that I could give you or anybody else. I've given it to people who've played on the Solheim Cup team, I've given it to US amateur champions, I've given it to people who've won major championships at the professional level. All of them have seen the one and only Sevi Ballesteros, Severiano Ballesteros from Spain. Some of us will remember him, for some he's a distant memory. Um, you know, for you young guys, you just know that, yeah, he was kind of good. He was brilliant around the greens, but he did one thing that we should all do. And I called it stare at the target, glance at the ball. Every piece of video I've got of Seve would have him with a short game shot where he was the wizard extraordinaire starting some amount behind the ball and you could see him moving his head and lifting his chin and visualizing the flight of the ball and the, the club for him was always in his right hand and it was always sort of pretty loose and light as he was walking in. But this is the bit that I think was magic for Seve. He would walk into the ball every time and as he's walking in, he's looking at the target. Maybe he could see the ball out of his peripheral vision, but he's looking at the target. Still looking at the target, still looking at the target. A casual look at the ball as the club goes down, back at the target, back at the target. A little tug on the trousers there, which I don't think was without its consequence. That keeps the arms relaxed. Then back looking at the target, then look at the ball, one more look at the target, and then the great Seve would go. So I'm going to try and put that in real time. And what does that do? It keeps your thoughts out there where you want the ball to finish. The last thing you want to do is have all your thoughts down here. A lot of people just, they're down here, and they're down here a bit more, and they're down here, and then they might say, look at the target, and it goes like this, bing, bing. You want to stare at the target and just glance at the ball. So in real time, with the greatest of respect for the great Seve Ballesteros, picture the shot you're trying to hit. That's number one. And as you walk in, maybe shake the tension out of your lead arm like Seve would always do. I'm seeing the shot in my mind's eye before I hit it. Casually place the club behind the ball. And I'm back to the target. So I'm staring at the target. I'm glancing at the ball. I'm staring at the target. I'm always moving. I'm not too static. I'm not a statue. I'm going to stare at the target. When my eyes come back and see that ball, I'm going to go stare at the target, glance at the ball, and then I go. Something like that. Stare at the target, glance at the ball. I think it was one of Seve's greatest secrets to being maybe the greatest short game player ever. And I want you to try it, and I'll tell you why. Because I think it's going to help you play better.